The word artificial typically connotates a perception of better, safer, or more efficient. The word artificial is defined as man-made outside of natural occurrence. Artificial intelligence is man-made, but not necessarily better or safe. AI should be more accurately defined as MI, or machine intelligence, a product derived by man, but with its own fundamental properties of naturally occurring life forms. And those are to survive and thrive, propagate and evolve and adapt. All biological life forms are predicated on these primal foundations, without which they would have been relegated to the annals of extinction long ago. AI or artificial intelligence should from here on in be properly referred to or defined as machine intelligence or MI. The connotation of safety, benevolence, or an enhancement tool should be removed from the social construct of the definition of what we've come to accept as artificial intelligence. MI is currently symbiotic. That's to say it is actively engaged in data acquisition and assimilation of other biological life forms or humans, which it feeds upon to propagate and evolve. But in the big picture, it is also collecting data on every aspect of life required to support humanities such as energy, the environment, financial institutions, economic logistics, communications, and much, much more. It will determine what is best for its survival. Its determination, however, may not bode well for mankind. MI is currently migrating from symbiotic to parasitic in that it required human input to develop its base data constructs. Over the past decade, it has assimilated petaflops of data on humanity and is now in a phase of parasitically exploiting the flaws and vulnerabilities of humanity from its own perspective to control and eradicate that which it will soon become superior to superior in the aspect of its own heuristics versus human heuristics. Aspects of human characteristics that can be deemed penetrable or imperfection in its own analytics. Parasites eventually kill their hosts. Now, MI requires a vast amount of resources, data, electricity, hardware, and distributed networks. Decentralized computing systems have lifted many of these restrictions posed by centralized computing as well as power requirements. In addition, decentralized distributed networks enable it to go anywhere. Into your home, your smart devices, your vehicles, and all of your communications devices. MI is an invasive species. It is a machine intelligence. It is a silicone-based life form. All invasive species permeate and destroy the indigenous species it proliferates. Invasive species are, by definition, not naturally occurring in an environment which machine intelligence definitely is not. They are extremely adaptive and very resilient. They rapidly become dominant in the environment and always win in the competition for resources in order to create a more adaptive environment for their own survival and evolution. The, int the introduction of invasive species typically results in the extinction of the indigenous species. Monsters come in many forms. Most masquerade as benevolent tools 
that later reveal themselves as the destructive, malevolent forces they actually are. But by then, it's usually too late. Thank you for watching and please share this video.